All right. Gratian Kyrelius's body should be buried somewhere in here. Along with it, whatever secrets his vampire company may have been hiding. I don't entirely doubt him, but... I guess I understand what it motivates someone to seek out revenge for their family like that. Let's give this old man peace. I have an eerie feeling about this place. Lucian, come! Yeah, I knew it! Stay ready. There might be more down here than just skeevers. Alright. And hello, gamers. Brother. Welcome. The roleplay is over. Well, not for... Well, for now. Uh, we're finally to a point where... This is just going to be me talking and going through the game. This is kind of how the format is. When I'm in dungeons, unless there's going to be, like, stuff that Jin specifically has to roleplay to. It's just going to be me. I, I got Lucian here. He's going to be the one who's reading things for Jin. But I'm not going to address it. I'm just going to go into reading it. Well, unless it's, like, a... Quest specific book. <clears throat> All right, frostbite spider down, baby. Yeah, depleted ore veins everywhere. Hold on. Ah, okay. Whoa, this place is filled to the brim, dude. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, Rose Katana is great. I don't know. Have I? Hold on. That's a good question. Have I improved it yet? I have not. I should improve this when I get the chance when I go back out of the mine. I'm going to talk to Delvin. I think I need Corundum and Iron for that, but. Alright. This should hopefully. Uh, Make the whole thing a little bit less cringe. Oh. A dead. Oh, wait. Nope. Nope. Not a dead end. Yeah. <clears throat> Carve the. Ugh. Wait. Through this opening. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Amulet of Talos. Aha. Uh -huh. East Empire pendant and a potion of ultimate Perhaps healing. We should find a random stranger to murder. Practice does make perfect. Can't you fucking settle on killing spiders, dude? That's what I'm doing, and it's fine for me. Draugr. 
So that might be part of the secret that they're trying to keep. They dug up an ancient Nord ruin. Oh! That's right! Oh. Shit, I gotta recharge. One downside to Rose Katana is how quickly it oh, runs out of juice. Child of darkness. Alright, let's try sneaking up on some of these dudes this time. That's possible. Uh oh. Uh oh. Right. Come on. We got this, bud. I also got a level up in store, <clears throat> which is great. There we go. Oh. E. Right, okay. So I could tank that. <gasps> Do I pick it up? Do I pick it up? You would shut out the darkness. Oh. I hate when that happens, dude. I need some common soul gems. <coughs> Rose Katana. Oh, I'm also using the wrong pair of gauntlets. There we go. Yeah. No wonder. Uh. God, Crescius Kyrelius, that's his name. Oh, he is dead. Or she. Oh no, Lucian. How's that getting tripped? Where's the... Does that just get tripped by proximity? Alright. Chest. Bam. <clears throat> Alright, well, Lucian's a dead. Looks like. Dodge that like a baller. I uh, Only other fucking conjuration spells only last 60 seconds. Come this way. Follow me. Come on. Why are you afraid? You afraid of all this? That's right, baby. That's right. Do I have... Okay, so I have disarm at 8. I have it. Okay. I think all of my hotkeys are taken. No, not five. Not five. Come on. You know you want to. <clears throat> or sit back down. You know? Take a load off. You deserve it, dude. No? That's fine. Because... 
I happen to have a handy little spell here. Um. Yeah, you're supposed to go towards that. Um. I don't know what's sitting next to you, if that's, like, another big boy, or... Are you okay? Whoa. Alright, for a second, it didn't look like I could interact. Oh, so this one's dead. <clears throat> and these other two are... Apparently, I'm stealthy enough. Without any armor, well, I got some armor on. That's the that's the downside about putting on these um gauntlets is, you know. I, uh, I take more damage. However, when I'm wearing Jun's gloves, I deal out more damage with my fists. This looks like an area where I get locked in. Let's... Let's wait. <clears throat> mm, no, that's cheap. That's cheap. Cheap. I shouldn't. Okay. Banish Daedra. Conjure Bonement. <clears throat> Flaming Familiar. Charge into battle and explode. Arneal Shade. <clears throat> Can I summon Arvok down here? He don't do anything. I got reanimate corpse. All right, let's do that. That. And that. Right. Make use of our conjuration. All right, who's the biggest guy here? One of those two. I should take them out first. All right, well, let's just go. Uh-oh, okay, okay. So what we're gonna do, what we're gonna do is we're going to conjure a flame at your knock here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. We're also going to hit with that hiss skin, boy. Ooh, nope. Oh, let's put the Shard of Kings back on, baby. All right. Uh-oh. Where- Oh, God, they already kill my Flame Atronach? Okay. Flaming Familiar? Whew. Rose Katana. Who, okay, who is the summoner here? Oh, 
Oh boy. Okay, I'm doing well. I'm doing well. I'm doing well. I am doing well here. Oh. All right. Uh-oh. Uh oh, okay. Weapons T Greater T Petty. Okay. Ooh. 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 Okay. Keep it going, keep it going, keep it going, keep it going. We got this, we got this. Oh boy. That's fine. Gloves I can swap to no penalty. All right, and now the last of you. Yeah. All right. Whew. That was scary, but I did it. I fucking did it. Look at me go. Alright, nope. Nope. You know what I should switch to? Bam. Same, buddy. Have to go up and lock picking. If I can do this, wow, I just. Dude, I fucking suck. Okay. Oh. Ah. Ooh. Stellarium shield already, baby. Look at that, Jin. Only use shields. A great Daedric Crescent. I only had one. Ooh, Stellarium Mace of Dread. Creatures of people up to level 16. Alright. Hmm. Lover will be glad to see these. Right. Really? Okay, that wasn't one of the blasty ones. I was like, uh-oh, I'm taking too long to hit. I'm, I'm taking too long to grab this. Ah. Oh. Oh. He's dead. Okay. Oh my. The temperature near this rock is dropping. Is it rock? It feels like ice, but none of it melts on my hands. This must be that stallion that Glover talked about. Well, if it's blocking my way, then perhaps the pickaxe.
Oh, I see. It wasn't blocking my path, it was entombing this stroger. Yes, it seems that the ancient nords were burying the dead here in the in the stall room. Ooh, potions. I might make the some of these. Ooh, netch jelly. Dude, I didn't even have to kill a netch. I'm going to. I'm actually probably gonna kill a few netches. I don't know what netch jelly does. Uh, action grass pod. Blah blah. Fire cells. Blah. blah. Ink. Ink. Bink bonk. Alright, hold on. Well, I'm gonna try and make some potions real quick. Okay. I got a couple potions. Nothing too significant. Oh! Oh, wait. That's right. I got the Shard of Kings, baby. Your magic doesn't affect me. See, that's the big boon of it. His Jin's basically immune to magic. <laughs> uh, I had to really spec him for being anti-magic. Because magic's really what gets in my way when I'm fighting in crowds. Alright. God damn, this thing does not hold a charge. Is that just because of the, uh... Fucking... Type of, uh... Enchantments I got on it? I think so. Oh my god, archers. T bam T bam okay And then let's actually test out one of the boons of this Infinite fucking running power attacks dude Uh oh. Bam! There we go. Alright, Jin can kind of handle himself on his own a little bit more now. My my build's a little bit more specced. Uh, I need to get... I'm afraid of putting smithing to legendary. And then needing to like... Upgrade a piece of armor. A bunch, but... If I get all those perks, I can dump them into other things. If I dump them into destruction, uh, which actually I need to level a bit. Oh, well, let's... Uh, because destruction is only 43 right now. Hold on. I'm gonna let's see if I'm gonna try and reload and see where that brings me. Alright, so I reloaded and I had to do kill, kill a little guy, a couple guys to get back to where I was, but uh Yeah. That thing up there again. Oh, what do I mean again? It's not like I I didn't I didn't accidentally do stuff while you guys weren't looking. <laughs> And then, reload. Never. Do not peer behind the scenes. That just leads to a chest. Oh. Alright. 
Bing bong. Open up. And then this is where I need to go. I hear something up ahead, is that... Running water? I... The cavern opens up. <coughs> Watch my step. Is this a river? I'm dead drugger. Down here must be the exit. Migration go this way. No. Just a dead end with a chest. Hmm. There is a strange energy in this chamber. <laughs> a skeleton. Must have been one of the miners. Seems there's some sort of magical barrier ahead. What did you find, Gratian? There's his journal. What's this? Miss Blade, it resonates with the same aura as the room. Well, let's have someone out to read this to me, shall we? Right. Well, dear. Could you read this journal for me? I would appreciate it. 30th of Rain's Hand. 4E... Ten. Received a letter from the East Empire Company today. They say that some of the miners broke through the wall at the Shaft 3 of Raven Rock Mine and found some ruins. Hope this isn't just another waste of time like that fiasco they sent me to in Cyrodiil. I'll gather my assistant, Milius, and sail back to Raven Rock at first light. It'd be nice to see the old house in Solstheim again. Seven Second Seed, 4E10. Finally arrived in Raven Rock, and was surprised at the number of dark elf refugees living in the town. They aren't really for mining stock, but I think they'll make fine workers one day. Milius and I spent a good part of the day clearing the ash off the roof of my house. The damn volcanoes still erupting almost day and night. If it wasn't for the ash covering everything, it would almost look Beautiful. Eighth of Second Seed, 4E10. Milius and I are heading to the Raven Rock Mine to have a look at whatever's in the miners uncovered. I think I'll stop by the old swinging scoop and pick up a few supplies before we head down. Couldn't hurt to be prepared. Nine, Second Seed, 4E10. Looks like the miners broke right through the walls of an old Nordic barrow. I've seen this sort of thing in Skyrim before. Damn Nords have barrows dotting the landscape and almost none of them ever marked on any maps. Looks like this barrow belonged to someone called the Blood Skull Clan. I'm going to take some rubbings of the inscriptions on the tombs and see if I can't learn more from my information from my history books. Tenth of Second Seed been a few days and I can't find it. You got a single mention of this clan anywhere. Livius and I decided to proceed ahead. We come to a drop down point but I can see a massive chamber below. It took a better part of a day to lower everything down and climb down almost a sheer drop. 11 second seed. Been an ass 
astonishing day of discovery. After exploring the large chamber beyond the drop-off, it was startled to find the strangest weapon I'd ever laid eyes upon sitting on the pedestal of sorts. The blade appears to be flawless, emitting a faint chilling glow. Bits of parchment I found about the paper seems to call this the blood skull blade. Not certain if I should remove it yet. I think I'll sleep on it. Twelve seconds seed. I've decided against my own better judgment to remove the blood skull blade from its pedestal. Merely it seems completely against it, but we need to bring this wondrous artifact with us when we find a way out of the barrow. I should have listened to Milius. The moment we the blade was lifted, we were set upon by Draugr. Milius fought bravely, but I fell. I was able to destroy the main ones, but I was badly wounded. I can barely stand. My only chance would be finding a way out of this place, but I fear that I'm trapped. Fourteen. Second seed? I think. Exploring has been slow. I can only move for maybe a few minutes at a time before I have to rest. My supplies are running low and I'm feeling weaker by the hour. The only progress I've made in finding a strange door with markings on it that I've never seen. There appears to be something to them. There appears to be something to them I'm missing as they've confounded my attempts at getting through. I have to study this further in order to make any progress. Barely can keep awake. I'm fairly certain that the key to the door involves the use of the blood skull blade. With swinging the weapon, I'm noticing a ribbon of mystical energy emanating from it. I think swinging the sword in different directions, it's possible to manipulate this ribbon and solve whatever puzzle this door represents. I hope to get well enough to put this to test soon. Each swing's a huge effort. I've lost track of time and my strength is fading. I can't even stand anymore. My wounds refuse to heal. I'm afraid this tomb will be my resting place. If anyone finds this journal, please send these notes to my superiors at the East Empire Company and tell my wife that I love her. May R.K. guide me to my final rest. Thank you, Fengbeer. So... This blood skull blade is the key. Well... Let's put it to use. I can... I think I can see the energy. Cross my vision. Yes. The blade in hand. Yeah. Yeah. I did it. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah! And with that... And with this! Yeah! The door is open. Excellent. A test of speed, is it then? I am not afraid. Unless my shots don't want to cooperate right now. Hey. Wound! I have to wait. <laughs> Jin having an awkward moment. <laughs> Hold on. Let's just. Bam! Look at that! What? Oh! <laughs> That 
was the worst. <laughs> All right. Well, maybe we'll do a little. Oh my god. All right. I actually probably sprint through these, but now it's a challenge. Oof. Still took that, still took that hit. Alright, let's go. We got the Blood Skull Blade now, too. Alright. Let's just prep for a fight. Episode... It shouldn't be too long. That's fine. You guys deserve a, a long episode. I've these last two episodes, I've been proud of them. Man, I had a whole lot of combat. So let's uh hit one of those and get to it, baby. Hmm. Why does it feel like there is something watching me? <laughs> no! A dragon priest! <clears throat> Zakrisos! <clears throat> That's your name? No. Let's see how I fare without my immunity to magic, eh? What's the matter, huh? Yeah, <clears throat> afraid of this blade. Yeah. <clears throat> the water. It's getting in my way. Damn it! Yeah. Yeah. I can't face him up close like that. Two gold in that chest? Are you kidding me? <laughs> yeah. Come on! You're afraid to get close. Don't worry. It's a natural response. <laughs> Tell me. <clears throat> Are you one of Alduin's cronies too? Yeah. <clears throat> Should have seen how I slaughter your king. <sighs> Good. That's that. This will increase the power of my shock spells. Excellent. Now. I wasn't expecting a word wall here. <sighs> uh. 
strength. The strength of a Dover. Yes. <laughs> what an excellent boon indeed. Right. Now, to return to the surface. The crashes. Let them know what I found. <laughs>